Hello everybody, this is Judy out at the Veggie Plot. It's May 26, 2017, and I'm just doing going to do a quick little walkabout and show you what's been happening. Okay, this is mostly a garden diary for myself, but I, I enjoy watching other people's videos, so I thought people might want to know what's happening in Victoria, BC, Canada, see how things are going. So anyway, I'll just do a quick walk around. Here's my grape. It's already got flowers on it. That's fantastic. The um, raspberry's doing good. Got flowers. The uh, I had to prop up the um, plastic a lot better a couple nights ago. Oh my goodness, we had huge winds come through here. I'm amazed the greenhouses and the little plastic thing withstood what it did. But anyway, uh, it's much different today. Calm and sunny. It's supposed to be getting very warm. Everything is in here. Things, though you can't notice it, things are starting to pop up in here. So I've reseeded a bit of um, stuff where I had bare spots in the the rows. Um, I have grass growing up where I planted the flax, so I'm going to have to get in there and try and take control of that. Also going to have to take control of all these uh, nasturtiums that come up here because they they're quite rampant and uh, very sturdy stock I tell you they'll take over everything lovely plants I think I'll bring some home with me put in some boxes anyway um, everything's starting to pop up my neighbor one of my neighbors gave me some of her sunflowers so I popped them in there um, potatoes this is where I've grown my potatoes and the other day I actually got some little potatoes. I was pulling out the sticks that I had in there and um, I thought it was a radish at first. I went, oh, that's nice. I have a radish. And then I realized it was potatoes. So I went digging and I found a whole bunch more small potatoes. So that was lovely. The bees are finally coming out on the confrey. I don't know if you can see them buzzing around on there. They needed the warm weather too, I suppose. Ladies mantle. Um, everything's getting a little taller. Uh, and this area here is where my ducks are coming. I don't know if I told you, there's a pair of mallards, a female and a male. And uh, she had an injured leg, but it seems like since I've been giving her a bit of food and there's water there for them, the, uh, she seems to be on the mend. So I have a feeling they'll just fly off and they're in better condition when she's in better condition. I didn't see any ducklings, but with her leg being the way it was, she probably wasn't able to... Uh, keep up with them or protect them who knows and anyway no baby ducks that I can see um Jerusalem artichokes is slow this year but are slow this year but that's okay you know I've eaten my fill of those things um they're just nice as a perennial crop and uh when they do bounce through that it's uh usually it's a very good windbreak so I missed that windbreak my squash are coming up. I um, planted a couple of extra squash in this corner. One's a zucchini and one's a squash. And I'm going to actually plant potatoes in around these guys because I brought some potatoes from home that I didn't realize was under my kitchen uh, cabinet. And they were starting to sprout, so no sense in wasting them. I'll bring put them in out here. If they come up, great. And if they don't, they don't. Uh, they're always good for fixing nitrogen in the soil anyway. So here I planted uh, my blue corn. I got all these sticks over top of it because of uh, the crows were watching me quite intently. Uh, the lovage is growing up as usual. It's starting to flower already. It's not really that tall, so things are a little delayed this year. My honeyberries is normal. I threw some wood ash down where those ants were and I haven't seen any in a while so either they've moved or uh, I don't know hopefully they've moved. Um, more squash in here. I stuck my little marigolds around everywhere. My onions, multiplier onions are up. It's nice. Garlic is doing well. This corner is doing well. I've got all my tomatoes that I'm going to plant. I could plant some potatoes along here too. Um, I'll find spots for them. I just pop them in. I was watching a video on uh, Ruth Stout. 
She was the sort of like the pioneer of um, planting your vegetables under hay and mulching type of thing. She, she lived to be, I think, almost a hundred. She was still out there gardening. But um, anyway, I admire people that I'm a lazy gardener. You know, at least I have to do. I do no till. Try to do no work. <laughs> Anyway, that's about it. Oh, I'm not going to pan around because there's quite a few people out here um, working today and they might not want to be on video. So just a nice shot of the blue sky and trees. Okay, take care. I'll talk to you again. Bye now.